I don't know if this lighting is good enough or not, but it'll have to work. Someone's running some kind of machine outside. But of course someone's running some kind of machine outside. I'm trying to make a video. <laughs> I do it out in my garage because uh, I feel like I have more privacy. And uh, my kids make fun of me sometimes for making videos. They're like, oh, geez, Mom. I post most of them on Facebook for my friends and family to see. I'm very honest with them about my schizophrenia. Uh, mostly because I think I'm a genius and I want them to all know what I think about. <laughs> they have no interest in the things I'm interested in. Like physics and chemistry and just genius things. Nerd stuff. I have a huge periodic table tapestry hanging in my bedroom. That's what a big nerd I am. I collect silicates. I'm a big collector of stones and silicates because I believe that our souls come from heaven into the silicates and then from the silicates into the zygote. And then when we die, our souls go to the stones and from the stones back up to the stars. And so silicates are very important. I also believe the vibrations of the silicates in the ground is what informs the earth's life of the seasons coming and going. And I think that silicates help birds migrate. So us digging up all the silicates and breaking it into pieces and selling it to people is messing with the migration of the birds because the silicates aren't in the ground to vibrate to show them the direction they need to go. So I try to teach my silicates to frequent and throw their frequency where it needs to be or to somehow change their frequency so the birds still know where to go. I use highly powerful magnets to uh, increase and propagate growth in my silicates. I know that quartz crystals are said to power the electromagnetism of the core of our planet, in which case they power each other because if magnets can make silicates evolve or grow, there's energy being transferred from the magnet to the silicate. And so since quartz is known to give the core of the earth energy, it is a give and give relationship. Um, that's how I wish all life was. I wish it was all give and give, but it ain't. 